Hello, everybody. This is Joel here with App Discipline. And um, as you can see behind me, we got my Christmas tree going. We got the Christmas lights. Ornaments still need to go up. Um, but you know what else goes um, right along this, this holiday time with lights and trees? Music. That's right. So many different music apps out there, so many different websites. Um, some are free, um, some are paid, but you know what? Um, there's a couple that stand above the rest, and I think that Spotify is one of them. So if you're a Pandora user, iHeartRadio user, Shazam user, um, I'm going to give you some reasons why Spotify um, is definitely something worth checking out. Um, so let's kind of break it down and get into it. Um, so I have my Spotify app open. Um, and you can see um, I'm just right kind of in the home tab here. And it's cool. It gives you a lot of different options to browse the music by. Um, so it, at the top here, it says, you know, made for you. Um, you can get recommendations um, the more you listen. So it's got a really crazy algorithm. So as you kind of um, put together playlists with different songs, uh, different artists, it figure out, figures out what you like to listen to, and it's going to recommend different stuff. Um, and then based on channels and stuff that you um, choose to listen to, it's going to give you um, similar music that you can check out. So I have a station in my library, library called Rock Out with rock songs that I you know, listen to when I'm working out, and it's going to show you some similar stuff. Um, so it kind of gives you ideas of, of other stuff that you can listen to. Um, cause a lot of times, you know, new music, it, it could be hard to find. You have to actually put an effort in or you have to have that one kind of music guru friend who shows you everything. So Spotify, uh, definitely helps with that. Uh, you got recently played, uh, oh, got my love playlist there. Little Leanne rhymes. Gotta love that. Um, and it shows popular playlist. Other people are, are listening to, um, it's got all the top charts. United States Viral 50, uh, Top 50, Global Top 50. Um, you can even listen to podcasts, uh, which is really cool. So if you're not a big music person, whatever, uh, you know, if you're, you know, just sitting there in traffic, you got all sorts of different podcasts that you can listen to. Um, you even got Spotify original video series, uh, which is really cool. Um, so I'll just click on this one. What music happens here? Uh, so you can follow, and it's going to tell you every time uh, a new video pops up. And it just has little specials. Like you can see, this is uh, the music happens here in Nashville. Gives you background on Nashville artists, does video interviews, behind the scenes at concerts, uh, you name it. So something that I thought is really cool, too, is that you can actually choose music by mood. And that's awesome because, I mean, what really you know, determines if you like or don't like a song, it's how it makes you feel, the type of mood that it puts you in. So, you know, if you're feeling sad, you can, you know, choose to listen to, you know, that kind of more down music. Um, you know, you've got good vibes channel. If you're in a good mood, you can keep it going. You've got songs to sing in the shower. Um, so it's just, you know, kind of a different way that you can browse. And then when you click on the browse section here, you know, it, it just has a lot more different ways that you can do it as well. So it's got the channels, uh, you can see the charts, new releases, uh, discover, you can look at uh, concerts in your local area or cities that you might be traveling to, um, search. So that's where, um, you know, you can search for all the different, you know, songs, artists, albums, podcasts, videos, different playlists, even find friends. So let's just say you want to listen to Justin Bieber, oh, not Nustin. You can type in Justin. You got so you got more Justin Timberlake. There's Justin Bieber. Uh, you can shuffle play all the songs. Um, you can click on certain albums. And let me remind you, I'm actually on the free version, which is a little bit limited. But if you have the paid version. Um, you can really get any song you want, basically, if the artist is on Spotify. And then you just download them, and it goes straight into your library. So with the free version, you kind of select the songs and artists that you want, and it puts it into a playlist. Um, it starts by playing that song, which is really cool and kind of different from Pandora. 
Uh, but you can only re really listen to the playlist on the free version um, on Shuffle, and you kind of have to wait for songs to come around. Um, you got radio. So just like Pandora and iHeartRadio, you can uh, choose an artist or songs and listen to that station. You know, so something that's a little different is like when I click on Bullet for My Valentine, it's going to tell you here under Includes all the different um, artists um, and songs that are actually included in the channel. You know, that way you kind of know what you're getting into there. And then in your library, you know, you can put together a daily mix. Um, you got all your different playlists that you put together. <clears throat> so you can see I have like my Bon Jovi playlist, uh, my dance playlist, only three songs in there. Again, so I guess I'm not a big dancer usually. Um, and you got your library of songs. Um, so you can see I have a, a couple <clears throat> on there. And then um, if you want to actually download them onto your phone, um, you actually have to do the paid version. Right now, it looks like there's a special three months of premium for 99 cents. The normal price is usually $9.99, which is pretty cheap. Um, and that's basically it. Um, it's definitely one of the most popular music apps out there. Um, it just has so much. It has some cool features, easy to use interface. Uh, interface. It's fast. Um, the free version doesn't um, bombard you with too many ads. And that's basically it. Um, definitely check out you know, some of the other ones out there. You got Pandora. Uh, iHeartRadio, Shazam, um, you know, but make sure you check out Spotify because I'm a big fan. And as you can see, it's a really cool app and it deserves a, a little peep. All right. Well, I hope you guys have a good day. Uh, in the description, definitely click on the link for the full review. You can click to the app store to uh, download and install on Android, uh, Windows, iOS. And uh, feel free to leave any comments and make suggestions. Have a good one.